Not so scary, but definitely interesting. Anyway, yes, this is Rayman 3, Hello Mavic. Now, I'll start off this, um, got... <laughs> that was called, which is basically Hello Army, and we're going to exactly what those are. We actually have to fight one. Oh, yes, yeah, so original that they have guns, they should have, yeah, whatever. The big thing here is you gotta go, you gotta collect the um, red lums as you come in contact with them. You can indeed miss them, but you just, um, you basically just keep going around in circles until you get enough red lums to restore your health. You are a jerk. Sitting us on a um, parachute jump without a parachute? Thankfully, we have our helicopter here, but still. Okay, I let that go on uncommentated because that is just pure gold right there. Just the that's the um, attitude of a lot of gamers that usually. Okay, okay, I can't fucking talk right, please. When manuals used to be this, this big thing where it came with a lot of games, that's a lot of gamers attitude. It's like why should we even bother reading these manuals? And that's not like it's gonna include anything, any useful information, anyways. And Murphy here just complaining about the, um, quote-unquote, useful information written in those manuals. Just brilliant writing. <laughs> There's all, yeah, that's also the, another big thing here, is that each time, we gain, each time we gain more points, that gets us into unlocking more stuff, as we've seen at the end of the last level. There are multiple, there are multiple ways to do this, but the main thing here... As you see with me snatching up some of these um, gnomes, is collecting these gems. Each more gems you collect in rapid succession, or each thing that scores you points in rapid succession, you gain more of a combo. It's really nice when you only want to score big, because that is absolutely necessary if you want to, well, unlock a lot of the bonus stages. Also, this right here is really cool. Just, let's listen to this glory. You can keep kicking the Snapper Turtle over and over again and she'll just say random quotes. It's just brilliant. Here, I'll give you a lever. Hey, come on. Is it right in my... Is it right in just right? There, enjoy your new husband. Take your husband! Take your husband! Okay, fine, you guys are couple. Okay, fine, you, you two are stubborn. Let's do a murder, I'll put the rest of the ship. Yeah, whatever. Ah, uh, why am I 
doing it. Uh, admittedly, that's a bit of a problem I have, is that um, whenever I play video games, I can very easily be turned around, which is really dumb. I don't even understand how that happens in the first place. Whatever, smack you up. Eh. All that goes might be that's a combo. Whatever. And oh right, there's that little worm thing that bounces you up. That can be kind of animal abuse, but yeah, whatever. Let's go where we need to go. Go through this log. Just this. Because I can jump. Yeah, that's a big whoop. Oh. Murphy has some... Murphy has a real gem right here. Just, just listen. Oh, that's, I gotta be on the bridge for that to happen. Derp. I don't... Okay, I did not mean to actually show that yet. And that's actually a big problem that um, I tend to have with this version of the game. And that's something you hear me complain about. Like your language there, maybe, because I think. Oh, won't somebody please think of the children? Yeah, think of the children mode, basically. But yeah, as I was saying, um, there's something can hear me complain about a lot. It's gonna be a main scene in this LP, I can just tell. This is the Xbox version, so if you press the LT, L LT button, you can go into kind of a picture mode where you can. Sort of control the camera. Control where the camera is facing. Control the um, angle of the camera. You can take pictures of stuff more than. You can, you can take pictures of more stuff than just Rayman. You can lock on this. You, you can lock on this stuff you want the camera to focus on. You can take a picture of that. Which um, I believe that's R two. Yeah, pretty sure that is. But we're not gonna be able to make use of that right now. Point being, you can take you can take pictures of very specific things thanks to this function. Oh yeah, you lacking suspense is a major problem, and we're the hero. <laughs> okay, you're nothing but paper. How can you possibly throw it down, okay? Just hit the switch or a walk on it. Trap glow box. And you know what? I'm gonna take a snapshot of this. Gotta take a picture. I do use the Nintendo consoles. And B when I was when I thought I was pressing A. And yep, the name I tells in is just binary. <laughs> now believe it or not. That is an achievement. <laughs> I forgot he said that. Wow. So, okay, so I was about to get this guy that I actually did not hit that barrel just there. That's any story in general, really. But now we got our fist! Our martial fist! The shoot button usually, yeah, uh, that's the attack with our fist. But. 
You can now perform a charge attack. Just hold down the button and boom. Now, let's go ahead and hit this switch. And while we wait, that's just a warning. All it does is activate a light, it's a light switch. Okay. Is it what's... Stick to the script? <laughs> yeah, cast the blame on your agent, man. If you get stuck with just a low paying gigs. <laughs> There is an achievement for completing 100% of your scoreboard for every stage. I've not been able to once pull that off, so... This is the first mention of Andre's actual goal. That... Hey, Andre is at, um... Andre is at Black Lum with arms. Yeah. The only lum with arms, actually, as far as I know. I freaking... Okay, that, that time was totally my fault. But yeah, I just hate that that, um... Picture button is that, um, button. But, these are the banks. As long as you have a semi-charge going on, you can break them. Typically, piggy banks all have good stuff in them, such as um, red lums and other gems. Yeah, I'm gonna call that magic, but I don't personally, but hey. Whatever. And it's actually thanks to that I missed the. There we go! Jeez, I don't know why I'm sucking so much. No, can you... Now there was clubbing for a bunch of gems, but you don't need me complaining. Hey, this is also an interesting mechanic is here. You can grab your punches around the shield so you can hit whatever's behind it. Uh, right, at th at this place, at this place is magic. How do you have it? You never mind. I'm not gonna bother crunching it. I could. I could also. Oh, and I neglected to mention that you can also zoom in on your picture as well. It is a nice little feature. I just wish it was it had different button mapping. And I think this is a I think this is a good shot. Okay, well, it's not expecting uh, Murphy to actually talk during that. Especially during the still. Anyway, this hoodlum is the first of the fight of this kind where you gotta beat up. This is a hoodmonger.
Welcome to our first of many power ups. It's pretty easy to see how this works. This is a hurricane fist. The first of the um we know game, we don't need you to spoon feed us. We're not stupid. What that does is, is you screw things in. It. Okay, more choice. Screw things in. Well, actually, yeah, since screws, screwdrivers. That makes sense. Sort of. That's not all the Harkin Fist can actually do for us. So that's that's all I can do at the very moment. Is get we haven't even fought with it. But does something rather interesting to the alums that is better shown than rather rather than described. I right, screw that down. Screw that platform down. I can't say for certain if I'm going to get an absolute perfect score in each of these stages, but I'll try my best to get as much as I possibly can. For the record, this is going to be a 100% run. I'm going to be going after all the cages. It's, spoiler alert, there are those. Yeah, I'm going to be tracking down every one of them, but I can't guarantee I'll be getting a perfect score. Oh my god, this music is so gorgeous. Uh, I'm gonna shut up a moment and let you listen to it. This soundtrack is just absolutely the most, uh, no, I can't say it's the most beautiful song I've ever heard, but it's definitely up there. It's very calm and relaxing, it's got a very calm atmosphere to it, I love it a lot. Remember 3 just has a really, really amazing soundtrack. And yay, celebrating something simple. Yeah, it just shows just how much of an asshole Andre really is. And now he's gotta find him and see where he is. And there's a scene you can just press the Y button. Well, excuse me, I'm only trying to find Andre. He only wants to, I don't know, um, destroy the world? Maybe? I'm a dumbass. I skipped the um, Hurricane Fists. Something else I gotta mention about these harps um, that is actually fairly important. Just for just for having a just for having one of these harps. If you see on me, <laughs> I'm not cleaning. Can I take a message? Okay, yeah, there he is. She's gotten serious. Andre is working the draw the world, and as we get further in the fairy council, you can see the breeze is coming down from the ceiling and running and stuff. Since everything is fueled by, well, this got the part of the world, which is, well, you'll know when you see it.
Er Okay. Yeah. And unfortunately, that gets us into something. Um, if enemies fall to um, hazards or... Heck, even other enemies, which... Enemy attacks do have friendly fire, I'm just gonna show that if I can later on. You'll be getting the points of that, so if you're aiming for a ridiculous high score, be careful of that. It like it's how like music gets all serious because of ev just everything just crumbling apart slowly. Because Andre is working the heart of the world, because everything is going into chaos. Good thing or bad thing that um, Glovox actually swallowed that black lum. Sounds pretty disco esque. It's still some pretty awesome music. <laughs> and we can see why Andre hasn't touched it yet. I love how all these TTs are just around the um, heart of the world, just dancing to this groovy music. I'm more of a metalhead. But, yeah. Yeah, the turtles are going, getting on it. was originally planned for um, Rayman 4, but unfortunately that got scrapped, and I'm not, I'm not saying Rayman Origins is a bad game. No, I think it's an amazing game. But it still hurts Murphy say, see you in, in Rayman 4 when there wasn't one. Ugh. But on the right side, we now have our objective. We need to separate, um... Andre from Glowbox, which is a really good stopping point here. On that note, unfortunately, this, this entire area is just empty now. But anyway, next time on Let's Play Rayman 3 Hoodlum Havoc, clearly, clearly for us is where we're heading to take Glowbox to the Rich Doctor. See you guys then.